When Madeline Cartwright became the principal of an inner city elementary school, she found a desperate situation, a filthy building, a discouraged teaching staff, apathetic parents, and children who were just trying to survive in an unbearable environment. Madeline had many reasons to be discouraged, even to think that change would be impossible. One day, she pulled aside the custodian to talk about the stench that permeated the hallway from the boys' bathroom. The smell is coming from the floor. There's 10 years of urine in the concrete. It won't come out. I need a bucket of hot water and some brushes. Word spread quickly about the new principal's action that day. Students and faculty alike, even parents were talking. Even out in the community, they talked. Soon, everyone was involved and engaged in the new school spirit. A culture of doing what it takes emerged among the faculty and staff. Together, they faced head-on and overcame the challenges that were preventing children from learning. They provided food, took care of medical needs, and even challenged the rampant drug dealing in the neighborhood. Academic achievement improved measurably, and the school was changed.